Hello everybody, my name is Python and welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved from the island. We're on the sixth episode guys and thank you so much once again for all of the support you guys have been showing the series. I truly do appreciate it guys. If we can keep it up with let's say a thousand likes per episode that would be absolutely beautiful. It really really would. That would be enough to tell me that you guys are still interested in seeing more of this series. Now in today's episode we are going to successfully no matter what happens we are going to successfully take a raptor. That is right. We're going to tame ourselves a raptor and also we are going to try our hand at trying to get ourselves our first ever kibble. I have never made kibble in Ark Survival Evolved. It involves the cooking pot and the kibble I need is simple kibble because you guys were saying that we should try and tame this thing called the Ikus or Ikus. Not entirely sure of the pronunciation but basically it's a horse. A horse which has the ability to knock out high-end dinos in a single back kick like buckaroo the game. So, that would be pretty freaking awesome to go for. So, to start off, we are going to hopefully go for a raptor, and then we're hopefully going to go for a level up. We do have ourselves... We've got two levels up now. Okay, that's epic. So, we'll have ourselves health, and we'll go for weight, and we've got 55 points. So, what we need, the limiting factor is a medium crop plot. At level 26, we can get ourselves a medium crop plot. And we need, specifically, a medium crop plot or larger. Because we need to plant rock carrots. Rock carrots cannot be planted in small crop plots, sadly. And we need rock carrots as part of the simple kibble recipe. Other things we need is cooked fish meat, a small egg. I've got two of them. I've got fiber, media berries, and then water. Put them all in a thingy, and then we're good. A thingy. I'm very good with my descriptions, aren't I? A cooking pot. There we go. But anyways, guys, we have ourselves a task. I am going to tame a raptor, wherever the devil they may be. I don't know. This seems like... Oh, there's a Therizino over there. Oh, I should probably keep out of his way. Just like an Enderman, I should, like, stay away and stuff. Right, I'm looking for, well, hopefully a singular raptor would be uh, preferred, I'll be honest with you guys. So, are there any? No, doesn't look like it, does it? Alright, well, it looks like we're having ourselves a little bit of a search around, guys. Hopefully, we can find one in a good amount of time. They are usually, like, super common. So, guys... We haven't just found ourselves a raptor. We found ourselves a tech raptor. Huh? I mean, come on. That's got to be pretty epic, right? Oh, 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 okay. So that took, what, four arrows? Cool. It's only level 14, though. That's the issue. Uh-huh. Right, is there anything... Oh, God, where's Polly? Where did I leave Polly? I've got nothing to take this guy with. Ah, Polly, come here. I mean, well, maybe maybe they can take the freaking stuffs, the cooked meat. I don't think it tames as much, but I think it would still tame it. All right, cool. Here we go. Wow. I can't believe we've got a tech raptor, guys. That's amazing. Right, so here we go. Boom. That's all yours. Uh, I tell you what, I will take a couple, though. Boom. One, two. I thank God. I thank God. Oh, is it raw meat? I think it's raw meat. Oh, no. Okay. Um... Raw meat? Hello? Is there any dodos around? Or something small? I need to kill something! Oh, Jesus Christ. I need to kill something. Aha! Good day to you are my victim. And you are now dead. Right, here we go. All the meat now belongs to me. All right, now we need to go find that tech raptor again. I can't believe we've got a tech raptor, man. That is so awesome. Oh, dang, dude. All right, are there any, like, special properties to having a tech raptor? To be honest, I don't really know. There you go. Oh! He, she does eat the thing. Okay. That's epic. That is actually kind of epic. So, this next one will tame out. It'll only be level 20. That's the only issue. It'll only be level 20. It would be nice if we could get ourselves a male tech raptor. Ah, uh, it'd be kind of cool to breed tech raptors, wouldn't it? Ah, uh, that'd be kind of amazing if you ask me. Don't mind if I do. All right. Well, I guess at this point, all we do is wait. I think it has to go 50 below the maximum amount of food in order for a carnivore to eat a piece of meat. So, yes. Also, I found an egg. I found an iguanodon egg, and no one came round to claim it. So, I was just like, oh, hey, that's epic. 
Right, so let's get rid of that real quick. And any second now, there you go. Tech Raptor. Yeah, buddy. Terry. Terry the Tech Raptor. Awesome. Right, so I tell you what, yeah, you could just you could just follow me. In the meantime, I'm going to ride this gal. Okay. Okay, this is this is epic. Woohoo! Oh yeah! I got a tech raptor, guys! Oh, this is epic! Look at me! It's like red and everything. It's like red and green. Yo! That is awesome! Alright, buddy. Uh you could just like come that oh god. Okay, yeah, that kind of hurt a little bit. I wouldn't make a habit of doing that. Oh, oh gosh. <laughs> Just doesn't give a crap. Just doesn't give a crap. Oh, was that a moss chops? Wait, oh, I'm seeing things. Hmm. If there was another moss chops, I would 100% tame it. Because I want another one, man. I want another one. Yeah. I want another moss chops because I miss Molly. I miss Molly. I want to get another Molly. I do. I want to get Molly too. That's what I want to do. I want Molly too. Hey uh, guys, someone ought to tell this idiotic megalodon that uh, shallows are probably not a good idea. Uh, do you know what? I'm going to be the guy who does that. Yeah, do it! Okay, maybe not. It went away off its own accord. Great. Okay. Well, uh, I was going to try and do a smart thing there, or at least an interesting thing, but uh, nah. It ain't going to happen, guys. Come on, moss chops. We're looking for a decent level moss chops. Oh my god, those are Trodons. Alright, here we go. I'm going for it! Trodons! Trodons! Go on, get- Oh, the copies. I thought they were Trodons. I'm an idiot. Alright, here we go. Go on, go on, go on. Get! Get! Yeah! Alright, alright, alright. That's kinda cool, man. Alright, we're gonna sort another level up. Let's go for melee damage this time. I did go for, I think it was health for the first time round. As we level up this gal, we should get ourselves a whole bunch of stats. Oh my god. Look at how many dodos there are. Jesus Christ. It's dodo land. There's literally eight of them. What the crap? I've never seen so many dodos. That is insane. <laughs> uh, so all of those are lystrosaurs. We're looking for moss chops, ideally. Uh, oh, that's a moss chops. Hello. What level are you? 60? Oh, my gosh. Rare mushroom. Ah oh, man. Where do you get raw mushrooms from? Or oh, rare mushrooms, more to the point. You get them from caves, don't you? Ah, oh, dang blast it. Oh, there's a freaking spino ahead as well. This doesn't seem like a good idea. I mean, I could go to a cave and maybe get some, but I don't really feel like I'm strong enough to the point where I could do that yet. Well, I did see a level 20 moss chops like right around the other side of the beach, so I might go ahead and do that one instead. It only required media berries, so maybe as it turns out, the higher the level the moss chops, the more sort of rarer the resource you need to feed it. That would be my theory anyway. Aha! Uh -huh. Cool! Alright guys, let's go get ourselves a moss chops. I want another one! I want a molly too! I told you man, I want a molly too! Ah! Turns out the level 20 needs raw prime fish meat! Which requires killing megalodons. I don't feel like doing that, so we're gonna try and find ourselves one that just takes Mijo berries, okay? Come on, man. There's gotta be one. Do you take Mijo berries? You do take Mijo berries, but you are level four. Dang, dude, that is low. There's gotta be a higher level than four that you can still tame them with Mijo berries, right? Come on. Uh, come on, man. There's gotta be something. Hey guys, check this out. We got a level 44 male one. Only requires Tinto berries. Well, I mean, it's not like those are super difficult to find, right? Tinto berries, you can just get them from here. There we go. The little red berries. Awesome. Oh, man. So it seems to be a little bit of RNG, really, finding yourself a moss chops, a decent level moss chops that only takes, like, berries, I guess. There you go. I only took one. Okay, Marlon. There you go. Your name is Marlon. All right, cool. Right, so you could follow and then you could... Ah, oh, dude, this is so cool. And then, look at this, guys. Oh, look at that. 289 fiber. What a great resource to have. Damn, dude. All right, well, uh, that's pretty much just... Uh, <laughs> that's filled this guy up almost instantaneously, guys. Jeez. That's a lot of stuff, isn't there? Look at all this. I mean, we don't need that much wood, let's be honest here. All right, well, he's already got... Oh, my God. Three levels up! What the hell? All right, boom. Do, do all the things. Yes! 
We've got another boss chops, guys. So we are now back up uh, to, well, we've got two new dinos. Well, I said two new dinos. One of them's a new dino. And then one of them is like a replacement for an old dino. Yeah, that sounds pretty good, huh? Uh, we still don't have a replacement for our Pego from earlier in the series, though, do we? So, yeah, we could probably do with doing something about that. Uh, also, I need to make sure this guy has always got, like, max health. Because, yeah, this guy can be a bit of a tank. You guys have seen the amount of damage this guy can do. Or the old moss tops. They're kind of nuts, guys. They're kind of nuts. So, let's get back to base. And what we're going to do... Do we have a level up yet? Yeah, we're still level 25. Dang it, man. Mm. Maybe we need to go on a little bit of a killing spree? I mean, I'm down for a little bit of a killing spree. Yeah. I mean, I'm not really feel like feeling like I need to build anything at the moment. So, yeah, maybe a bit of a killing spree is needed. So, let's get ourselves down here. Also, I also came to the realization that, uh, you know, we've still got quite a lot of engram points left. We never actually saw what we could unlock. Magnifying glass. Uh, we have a pike, a crossbow. Okay, a pike could be a good idea. So could a crossbow, to be honest. So we'll go for both of those. Uh, do we have a smithy table? Yep, yeah, we can have ourselves a smithy and a metal pick. And we've still got nine left, guys. We can have a parachute, stone walls, stone fence foundation. I think going for some more wooden-related stuff might be a cool idea. Wooden double door. Now that's kind of epic. However, we need to go a little bit before that. Where's all the other wooden stuff? There we go. Wooden trapdoor, wooden window, wooden ramp, stairs, shield, triangle stuffs, ceiling, door frame. Yeah. All right. Yeah. That's kind of epic. All right. So as we rank up the next few ranks, I think we're going to go for some building resources. Why the heck not? But in the meantime, guys, we're going to take Terry out for a little bit of a kill spree. That's what we're doing. Oh, yeah. Oh, double, yeah. I'll take two levels up. All right, so let's increase your damage, and then I am going to increase myself. I'm going to go for a little bit of... Let's do movement speed. Why not? Some of you guys have been uh, craving that I do movement speed, so there you go. Medium crop plot. Ah. Oh, all 21 will be used to unlock that. Cool. Right, so now what I can do finally is make a little bit of a start on planting down some rock carrots. And the reason we're doing that, like I say, is we're going to be making kibble. And then once we find some equus or equi, I don't know what the plural is, then we will hopefully be able to tame them with absolute ease. Whether we're going to do that in today's episode or not is another matter. I don't know where they spawn. Uh, so yes, I guess that's something we'll figure out later down the line, my friendos. But in the meantime, Check it out. I killed a Trillo bite as well. So we've got some stuffs all over that. All right, guys. So what do we need for a crop plot? Let's have a little bit of a look, shall we? We need ourselves stone, thatch, and wood. Uh, two of them, I think, might be with this guy. Oh, not this guy. They're moss chops. Where's the moss chops? Aha. Right, so thatch. Yes, lots and lots of thatch. Okay, so crop plot. Oh, not crop. Crop. There you go. Right, uh, wood and stone. Easy stuff, right, guys? Easy stuff. There's the wood and the stone. Should be pretty easy to get, let's be honest here. We could just head over here and just grab some real quick. Then, we're going to make ourselves a couple medium crop plots. And I think we're going to just plant rock carrots for now. We'll probably wind up planting, uh, you know, other things later down the line. But for now, I just want to plant rock carrots so we can have ourselves a little bit of kibble production, guys. I'd love to produce kibble. I really, really would. Now, one thing I will say is I'm pretty sure I've got the growing speed, like the crop growing speed, at like 10 times. So it should be a lot easier to grab ourselves that sort of stuff. So uh, we can make ourselves one of these. The limit, in fact, have been fiber. I would ideally like to make two so we could have ourselves like double production and all that kind of stuff. Also, I need food myself. Ah, you need to stay there. You were, like, trying to come after me the entire time. Okay, right. Uh, what was the limited factor? Fiber? Easily gotten. I mean, it's not like we don't have ourselves a freaking moss chops with epic stuffs now, you know. Ah, that's pretty good. All right, boom. Uh, I need food. I know, I know, I know. It's tragic. Right, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Sweet. That will do the job. Right, now. If I plant these right beside the beach, I'm pretty sure they will, like, automatically be irrigated. I'm pretty sure. 
Like, let's place one there. And let's place one next to it there. Not irrigated. Come on. There you go. Slowly filling up, but I think that's because of the rain. Uh-huh. Okay, so, I don't know if the poop I stored earlier in the series is still there. Oh, jeez, I overshot that, didn't I? <laughs> I'm such a dummy. Alright, so we go in here. It was in here, or in this one. Yeah, it's all expired. Dang it, man! Right, well, I need the rock carrot seeds, so let's grab those out real quick. We do have four. I don't know. I don't know if it's just one you can plant per time or multiple. I don't know. But anyways, do we have any poopsie doodles anyway? Can I myself poop? No. Okay, good to know. Good to know. There you go. So we've got one in there, one in there, and I can't do anything with irrigation yet, sadly. Uh, we need this stuff here, and I don't have any engram points left, my friendos. Well, that's a little bit of a pain in the butt. Can I put a water skin in there? Will that, will that water it? Is that something it'll do? Can I remote use it? Will that... I don't... Did that work? It's so 94 now. Okay, let me let me try that again. Let me try that again. Okay, so press 9. There you go. That's now full up. So put that in there. Remote use it. And 194. Okay, so you can remotely do it. Cool. That's good to know. For now, that's all we're going to have to do. Jeez. Well, that's kind of annoying. But oh well. It's all good. It's all good. There we go, my friends. All water skinned and watered up for now. I'm not actually entirely sure how long that water is going to last in terms of real life time. But uh, yeah, there was a couple of small poops and then one medium poop from the uh, power saw right there. So yeah, these things are now growing, which is kind of awesome. So uh, in an unspecified amount of time, we're going to wind up with rock outs. Awesome. I need that very much. So did you just poop? Someone just did a poopsie. Was it you? Was it? Well, I don't know who it was. Someone definitely did a poop. I heard it. I don't know where. Who the hell did it? Was it you? Was it me? I'm really confused. <laughs> oh well, doesn't matter. Alrighty guys, so so far we've had a tech raptor. We have also had ourselves a new moss chops. We've also done some crop plot stuff. So I think to finish off the episode, what could be a cool idea is if we go for a triceratops, a trike. That is right, my friends. We unlocked the trike saddle an episode or two ago. Oh, we need uh, a hide. So I'm pretty sure Terry has some. Aha! Yes. Okay, coolio. So let's go and make ourselves a trike saddle and... Yeah, hopefully 28 trank arrows will do the job. Because if it doesn't, I'm going to be a little bit sad. How much XP will that give me? A yeah, decent amount. That's a pretty good amount, actually. Okay, so I'm thinking what we do... Because the Triceratops are actually fairly slow, I might take Marlon. Because why the heck not? It's a bit of a tank, let's be honest, guys. So, pretty much everything here I'm going to just chuck away uh, in favor of being able to move around a bit more speedily. Uh, can I make myself... I mean, I've got 33 of these darn things. I can make myself quite a lot more trank arrows here. Jeez, there's a lot to be had here, my friend. So, we need to find ourselves a decent level Triceratops and go ahead and pwn it. A lot. Those guys take a lot of arrows to be taken down, my friendos. But once they are taken down, oh boy. They are good at getting berries. Oh, yes, they are. They're very good. All right, folks. A female Triceratops at level 56, in my opinion. In fact, to be honest, anything over level 50, I would say, is a pretty good base rank to go for in Arc Vanilla. So, here we go. Boom! I started something. I'm going to finish it. I'm going to put many, many arrows in your feet. And well, as you guys can cl as you guys can clearly see, we're not having any issues. Oh yeah, that's right. I should probably wait a few seconds between each of the arrows because uh, it's a lasting effect for a few seconds. The torpor from these arrows, right? So yeah. This going to take a while, man. Can I, like, shoot it in the... Ideally, I want to put the shots in her body. I think it does better in her body as opposed to the head. I definitely know that... Huh. That didn't take very long. All right. Well, cool. All right. Have you got any berries there, broski? 
Thank you. Appreciate you. Appreciate your existence. All right. Boom. All yours, friendo. I'll be honest with you guys. I thought that would take many, many more trank arrows, but uh, apparently not. Apparently not. We are, we are good. We're good at this game, aren't we? We're really not. I'm not. I'm not good at this game. <laughs> there's still a lot to learn. On my end, there's still a lot to learn with this game, especially late game. I'm not familiar very much at all with late game, like things like bosses. I've never, ever tried to take down bosses or anything like that. So, yeah. Anyways, that will come to very much later down the line because for now, we've got some freaking Pokemon catching them all type of dealios to do. So, let's go ahead and wait for this female trike to be tamed. Oh, we need to come up with another female name beginning with T. I don't know, Tamala? Is that a name? I don't know. Tamala, Terry, uh, I'm not very good with names, I'll be honest with you guys. I'll, I'll, I'll think of one. I'll think of one. Tara! There we go, Tara! That's gonna be your name. Tara is your name. Oh, yeah. Tara is your name, and Berry Gaining is your game. I'm good. I'm good at rapping, guys. Huh? All right, ladies and gentlemen, after quite some waiting, we are just about there with taming Tara the Triceratops here, guys. So, level 83 will be the starting level. That's very, very respectable, I'd say. You know, middle of the chain. You can go up to like 150 plus or something like that. Anyways, here we go. Tara, hello there, Budski. Right, if I could get myself a male trike, maybe, just maybe, I could breed them. Cool. Yay, look at me. I'm looking good. Boom! Oh, dang! That's a lot of berries. All right, what about thatch? Are you any good at thatch? Boom! Oh, my goodness me. Well, that's that's pretty much done it. Yeah. Uh-huh. Awesome. Okay, this is epic. Right, so let's go ahead and do weight. So I think weight and melee damage are the things we're going to go for. I'm pretty sure melee damage also increases your harvest rate, right? So that's pretty cool. Boom! Thanks! Appreciate you! Oh, another level up, huh? Alright, well, let's do it again! <laughs> awesome. Alright, guys. Well, three dinos. We got ourselves a Triceratops, a Tech Raptor, and a Moss Chops back in our repertoire as well. So, guys, that's going to wrap it up for today's episode. A nice productive one today, my friends. If you have enjoyed today's episode, a like rating would go a long, long way. Hit the subscribe button. Ding that bell if you guys don't want to miss out on future content. And as always, keep your hints, tips, and suggestions coming in, guys. I do read the comments. I really, really do. And I appreciate every single one of you guys. Thank you very much for watching. Have a fantastic rest of your day. And I'll see you guys. Later.